Well, good morning once again, and welcome back to Posh Cats Camping. We are still under lockdown, and uh, there are restrictions still in place, and uh, an announcement has been made that uh, campsites will be opening from July the 4th. So we're all very excited about that, but cautious, of course. We're off on a day trip, which means taking a lunch, and uh, we've filled the fridge with a few goodies. We're taking the dogs for a walk, and again, we're meeting up with our family, Sheila and Joe, our other posh cats, and uh, today we're off to Oldborough. made it to Fork Road Car Park in Oldborough and it's £3.50 for the day and I'm just going to grab my hat, it's pretty warm and I want to uh, prevent myself from getting sunburn there is a nice um, sculpture on the beach over there we're going to go and take a look at that in a moment this car park was recommended to us by Aaron and Vicky of Motorhome Chit Chat and uh, what a beautiful spot it is it's quite a popular little spot we're near the the main road here but we're surrounded the coastal road but we're surrounded in countryside and the beach so uh, let's go and have a little look around well I'm on the Suffolk coastal path here and uh, just to get our bearings, behind me here is Orford, and in front of me, and to my left now, is the Poscats, and uh, Thorpe Ness in the distance that way. And if we were to go further up on the north, the north um, of the east coast here, we would be in uh, Southwold and Dunwich, and uh, and continues right up to Lowestoft. So we're going to walk uh, walk along the, the uh, beach here. We're just going to have a look at the sculpture. So this is a scallop, which has been designed by a local artist, Maggie Hambling, in memory of Benjamin Britten, who was a famous composer that actually lived in Oprah. Uh, it's very large. So. And he uh, used to come for walks on the beach, okay. didn't he? Yeah, so, I don't uh, blame him. <laughs> this is to remember him by. Let's have a look. Bye. <laughs> Oldborough is uh, famous for its fresh fish down here. It's a few fishermen that bring a uh, catch to Oldborough.
What have we got here then, Sue? Snoops. That's a Snoops. That's a memorial that's erected by the local people to Dr. Robin Pierre Hatchison, who cared for them from 1931 to 59, and to Dr. Nora, his wife, who died 1981 while still caring. Oh. And I like his knitted tire. you come back in a couple of weeks the cross keys at Albro will be open and you'll be able to have food and drink out in the, on the promenade here but at the moment everywhere is closed Just admiring the pots and the gardens here and the little cottages in Albra. Just walked along to uh, Thorpe Ness, which is uh, about three miles from where we parked. Uh, it's very warm, but uh, glad to see that there's, uh, the cafes are doing takeouts, so you can get an ice cream or a sandwich and take it out. And uh, we're in the little village here, um, where it's a little bit bustle and bustle, really. Quite nice, not too crowded. But uh, we're going to have, gonna have a look over by the lake and see some swans. Oh, 
Hello. Have you had a rest? Have you both had a sleep? Have you? Nice and cool in there. The end of another lovely day trip. We've been uh, to Oldborough and Thorpness and uh, just been sitting here chatting away and it's 5.30 now so uh, time to head home and get some dinner and uh, it won't be long before we're out on another day trip so uh, we'll see you then. Bye bye now.